What's up guys? Hope everybody's doing well and having a great day. In this video, I've got multiple very interesting video footage to share with you guys of strange sounds in the nighttime sky, strange lights in the nighttime sky, and mysterious lights in the ocean of all places. Incredible video footage that we're going to come back and take a look at here in just a moment. But first, today's feature photo was sent in by Freddie V out of Florida of a fiery orange sunrise visible from his location in Florida. Checking in on the GOES X-ray flux over here at the Space Weather Prediction Center. A little bit of activity picking up in the last 24 hours, but nothing major. Looking at the Earth-facing side of the sun, you can see some new sunspots in active regions down here in the lower southeastern limb of the sun that could produce large solar flares here in the coming days. Overall, though, pretty quiet for the time being. Hopping over to the Yellowstone Supervolcano Caldera, looking at the seismographs that, that monitor the mighty supervolcano. It, too, has quieted down from the, the swarm activity that we saw 48 hours ago. And looking at the power outage situation over here at poweroutage.us, right now everything is in pretty good shape. Anticipating power outages, though, as large storms are brewing all across the country. The eastern half of the United States could see some inclement weather the next 24 to 48 hours, and also looking at a possible major snowstorm developing in the Rockies and the, the Sierra Nevadas out here in the western United States. So a lot going on that we're keeping a very close eye on. I want to share with you guys something out of Australia that I received here a few days ago from Vasi out of Melbourne, Australia. Not quite quite sure what this is and I'm going to ask you guys to leave a comment below and tell me what you think it is. It looks like one of those mysterious V-shaped crafts but it appears to be falling from the sky. It doesn't have a string attached to the bottom of it so if it is a balloon it's a very unique shaped balloon but here's the video once again sent in by Vasi that does have narration. Where is it? Can you see it? I can't see it. It could be a drone. Okay, right there, I slowed it down and, and zoomed in on the object, whatever it may have been. And as Vasi mentioned, it could have been a drone. If it was a balloon of some kind, it was shaped just like a, a V-shaped aerodynamic craft falling from the sky. It was falling very slowly, not quite sure what that was, but it was interesting enough for her to take out her camera and start recording this mysterious object falling through the sky above Melbourne, Australia. Going from V-shaped objects falling through the daytime sky to mysterious objects in the nighttime sky. Video footage submitted by Andrew Morris. Not sure of the location. I'm waiting to hear back from Andrew on the exact location. He spotted this mysterious light, and there's actually two, as you're going to see here in just a moment. The original vertical video is over here on the left. I inserted it for presentation purposes, so you can see just about how high this thing was in the, the nighttime sky. And based off of that view right there, I would say it was somewhere in the neighborhood of 5,000 feet, just around a mile high, and it was still very visible, wasn't making any noise, wasn't blinking. I'm heavily zoomed in over here on the left to try to get a better view of this thing that Andrew saw in the nighttime sky. And as you're going to see here in just a few seconds as he's watching this one, that again is not blinking, not changing colors, just kind of wandering around through the nighttime sky, you're going to see another one right there enter the field of view and then it turns off. Check that out. He wasn't expecting that. He was monitoring this one above his location and that one entered the field of view but it very quickly turned off so yet another mysterious light appears in the the nighttime skies above planet earth going from the nighttime skies to the ocean off the southeastern coast of florida near lauderdale by the sea once again in southeastern florida a young lady by the name of wendy noticed something very colorful off the coast of lauderdale by the sea and the video has narration that i want you guys to to listen to and here we go I don't know, guys. So weird. Everyone's saying that's a scuba diver. I just... Myself. <laughs> Maybe to Mr. MBB333, my sky guy. 
Okay, here is an example of bioluminescence. And I know that's probably what you were thinking when you were looking at this light that's in the ocean just off the coast of Lauderdale by the sea. And to be quite honest, as Wendy was watching this mysterious object lurking around out in the ocean, she thought maybe this was an example of bioluminescence. And bioluminescence, it's a collection of living organisms like you see right here. Here's an example of bioluminescence, and here's another example of bioluminescence. Those are living organisms. I don't think that's what Wendy was looking at here. This must be something entirely entirely different. Normally, bioluminescence is much bigger than what we're seeing here. It's normally blue. This looks like some sort of an underwater craft. I don't think that's somebody scuba diving out there because more than likely there would have been a very obvious boat somewhere in the vicinity of this light. This is some sort of a light that gets brighter and then it gets dimmer, then it gets brighter, then it gets dimmer. Typically, bioluminescence is one color, whether it be bright, dim, or barely visible, but it remains the same. It doesn't get brighter and dimmer, and this one seems to be changing orientation, almost like it's some sort of an underwater vehicle that she spotted, and there were other witnesses that, that spotted this thing off the coast of Lauderdale by the sea in southeast Florida. And right here is a good example. You can see how right here it gets really bright, then it gets dimmer again, then it gets bright, then it gets dimmer again. And let me pause it right here and zoom in. You can see there's almost three different colors. You can see the, the very obvious green, quite possibly a light green, and then underneath the green you can see what looks like red. So to me that looks like some sort of an underwater craft, some sort of an underwater vehicle spotted off the southeastern coast of Florida just a couple of nights ago on January 4th of 2024. And here's another good view of this thing that to me doesn't look like bioluminescence. It's the, the wrong color, gets brighter and dimmer, almost like it's some sort of a mechanical object spotted in the ocean by Wendy on January 4th. Great job, Wendy. Thanks for sharing. And as I mentioned at the beginning of the video, I also have video footage of some sort of a loud boom in the nighttime sky. Video submitted by AC out of the White Mountains in New Hampshire. The, the camera was pointed at the nighttime sky, but you're going to hear a series of loud booms that were once again recorded by AC. Here we go. Wow, that is incredible. Woke them up, went outside, again, pointed the camera up into the nighttime sky, was just recording the audio that they, they heard, and again, woke them up, and they heard it multiple times, some sort of a very loud noise during the overnight hours near the White Mountains National Forest in New Hampshire. If you guys happen to have heard that loud noise, please leave a comment down below in the comment section. If you guys have any photos or videos you'd like to share, you can send those to reports at MrMBB333.com. If you guys have any videos you'd like to share that are too large to attach, to the email come over here to the home page of the website you can always find a link down below in the description box look for this red banner that says have a large video it's a drop box drag and drop your videos into the drop box please include your first name date and location and i'll take it from there thanks for watching have a super day and be safe out there